at Thursday morning to Northern Michigan, we have seen some scattered rain showers, a little bit of cloud cover as we were overnight. But as we've gotten later on into our morning hours, seeing this start to clear out here. Now it's due to low pressure moving its way through the Ohio Valley. You can see all of the rain wrapping around it here. That's going to continue to push eastward. As it does, it's going to take the bulk of the rain with it. Might see a pop-up shower in the afternoon today, but other than that, most of us stay dry and we'll see a lot of sunshine. Let's take a look at Stormcast so you can get a better idea of all of this. Here's where we are now. Now, like I said, that pushes eastward, takes most of the rain with it, but on the back side, especially inland towards Lake Huron, could see some light scattered showers this afternoon towards your dinner time, but things do quiet down as we head overnight into your Friday morning, a little bit cooler than we have been the past couple nights. Now we go throughout the day on Friday, highs around 70 degrees or so, lots of sunshine, everybody stays nice and dry. See a little bit more cloud cover overnight into your Saturday morning, but as we start off your weekend, we'll still see some sunshine. It might have a little bit of rain through the Straits area in your afternoon hours, but the main event won't come around until later Saturday through our 8 o'clock Saturday evening. And if you look off towards the western UP in Wisconsin, rain showers popping up here. That's going to be our next system. Could touch off rain and possible scattered thunderstorms really through Saturday night, Sunday, and into Monday. That's evident here on your 7-day forecast, and we do see those rain showers, but... We do dry out as we head into Tuesday and Wednesday, and our low temperatures bounce back up into the 50s with our high temperatures remaining in the low mid-70s. Thanks for clicking at upnorthlive.com.